you're going to squeeze her out and apply it to the inside of the nail. So if you're doing your opposite hand, she is a breeze because you literally can apply the gel and you don't have to worry about it moving or anything like that. Hold it in place for about 10 seconds. And there you go. Look at that. No bubbles, no movement, nothing. She just stays in place. Isn't that dope? So you can freeze cure it, just so that way she doesn't go anywhere. In case she does want to move around a little bit. But that's it, just a few seconds. So you could literally, if you work fast, you can do all five fingers at the same time. And because it has a, like a, a bottle nose tip, you can use that to spread the gel around. What a bad habit to like want to hold them down. But like I said, you don't have to. And if you have fingers that are a little bit crooked like mine, you can move them around and make sure they're nice and straight. See? Before you cure inside the lamp. So let's give her a quick little freeze. What do you guys think? Do you love the DIY gel? It's a game changer, right? And you can also use our tube key at the end of it so that way you make sure you don't waste any drops. Bye bye! Are you coming tomorrow? Okay. Give it a few seconds. Press down firmly. And remember, I always recommend when using DIY gel, do a coat of press-on gel or a coat of um, pink press-on gel on the nail. And that will be your base coat to, to make sure you get the best adhesion possible and avoid any gaps. Super easy to do your non-dominant hand. Look at that, you guys. Beautiful. So now we're gonna freeze her for, no, we're gonna bake her, I'm sorry. For one minute inside the dazzling darling lamp. And then we're not. Tailor the nail, blend in those cuticles, and she's good to go, ready for the design. Can't get, wait to get mine in a couple of days. Fantastic. Love you from Chicago. And I love it. Hi from New Mexico. Prep is exactly the same. It just keeps getting better. I'm loving the stickers. Aren't they so dope? I'm so excited. And of course, we do have more stickers coming out very soon. We are making some English, uh, old English letters and some with bad words for the bad girls. Lots of really cute stuff. Very PG-13 for the children. Hi from Aruba. To do that, I don't understand what do you mean by a profile. And the cure time is still exactly the same one minute, so that does not change. So now we're going to tailor the phalange. Give 
give her that extreme score real now. How long did it take to apply the nail device? Like a minute or two? Literally. Make sure we got a really boxy square. Hi from West Tasmania. Are the stickers available in Australia? No, not yet. They just launched in America, so they'll be heading down under soon. interesting too when we were in Dallas we asked the lady that was one of our Lyft drivers or Uber I don't remember but we were like how are the freeways so clean here like why do you guys have blue bonnets all over the side and she told us that Lady Bird Johnson had started I guess like some kind of legislation about beautifying America's highways and it was because of her that freeways or highways whatever you call them have flowers on them and I was like wow that's a really nice little story I didn't know that Miss Lady Bird Johnson. Hi from Corpus Christi. Holy cow. What is up with Angry Face on site? Extreme Square is my favorite. So we're going to use first Diamond Manny bit. And we're going to begin the blending of the cuticle maker nice and airbrushed and seamless. Blend, blend. You guys know me. I am obsessed with a super snatch cuticle. And the more blended the nail is, the longer it lasts, the better it looks, the least amount of lifting you'll have. Just everything will be better. This one I actually put too close to the cuticle, that's why I'm having a hard time blending it because I made it a little bit too close, but that's okay. So now I'm actually going to use the diamond prep bit and I'm going to further blend out the cuticle. So not only will this help blend out the cuticle even more, it will also re help remove even more dry skin, giving me a really, really, really Russian manicure drill bit finish.
beautiful. Look at that, they look just like sculpted nails, you guys. Stunning. Do you guys know what your state flower is? Let me know in the comments below. I think mine is a cactus flower. Not the prettiest. Alberta White Rose. Hey Max, hi. That's a pretty flower. buffer and removing the entire shine off the nail. Cactus? Where do you live that your national flower is a cactus? No, our state flower is a cactus flower, I think, right? But not a cactus. The cactus flower. Orange blossom. Oh, an orange blossom smells so good, too. Red rose. Oklahoma rose. All the product, you can rewatch the video if you want to see exactly what products we're using, but we do explain it throughout the whole thing. California Poppy, Blue Bonnet. Hi from South Carolina. Beautiful, look at that shape, children. Stunning, stunning, stunning. So now let's remove the dust. Where did Gloria put my manicure brush? Gloria's always moving everything. Gotta love it. She left early today too. Oh, where'd you put it, Gloria? It's over there. Give me one second, you guys. Yeah, why is y'all here? Gave her husband by this and they started taking that to dorbs. Black eyed Susan, what's that? Hi from the UK. So, let's dive into the sticker fantasy. What should we do today? All so beautiful. We have lots of sales going on. What you talking about there, Willis? So I think we'll save the 3D for another time and place. Should we do something with stars or something geometric? Something with strawberries and teddy bears? Cherries, I did a cherry yesterday on Instagram. These are really cool.
Are the 3D stickers? Yes, they are. She wants a promo code, not a sale. It's almost the same thing. Big Sagebrush, Las Vegas, Teddy Bears. I see one for strawberries. Antique Rose. Ooh, maybe some unicorns for the girls. Roses, you can't go wrong with roses. Money, for the girls that like to go up and down the pole, some dollar bills, some butterflies. Shall we do uh, teddy bears and butterflies? So we'll do the purple. stars and moons to okay I think that's good I'll be very cute today so I'm going to use two very important tools when it comes to using stickers one is our silicone tool so they come in a five-piece kit we're gonna be using this one that looks like a finger or like a lipstick to me and we're gonna be using our pink tweezers to pick up these stickers and place them on the phalange a few tricks is never apply a sticker too close to the free edge okay you guys always try to leave a little bit of space between the the edge of the nail whether it be the free edge the cuticle area anywhere between the nail and the sticker okay can you buy the stickers in a bundle no they're only available open stock a la carte so always focus your sticker application more towards the center not too much too close to the free edge that's one and then you can also take our pink cuticle scissors and trim the uh, stickers if you want to, so that way they fit however you want the design. So let's begin with this teddy right here. So these stickers are super, super thin, okay? Always start on one side and work it towards the other way. So that way you make sure you don't have any bubbles. Okay. Yeah, that's what they wanted for the children and the phalanges mm -hmm. and butterflies.
So I like to bend the corner so that way I can peel it on. And apply. Let's apply a little teddy right here. giving you guys the fantasy you guys aren't they adorable Dorbs. What happens to the music? Lucy Frank has joined the Eagle, giving her all the sticker tricks for the girls. Ugh, jeez, YouTube and all their bloody ads. If you try to peel off the stickers with your fingers, it's a little bit more tricky. So that's why I like using the silicone tool. See? Lucy's ready for a teddy bear, she said. Ready for Bojangles. Okay, 
the butterfly wing. So that's the butterfly wing here on this whole engine. What do you guys think? the more you can fit. Not so adorbs. These nails are giving me the purple teddy bear cotton candy realness kind of thing. And the butterflies are so beautiful. Like literally, the possibilities are so limitless. Butterfly realness right there, that butterfly fantasy. They're all so adorable. Let's do... Let's 
to a green one. Put this one we're gonna put upside down. a great way to upsell any service or if you're not the best at nail art literally no you're an expert Can you put the stickers over polish? As long as that polish is completely dry, yes. But if the polish is not completely dry, you're gonna smudge. So make sure whatever you're putting the sticker over is completely dry. but not too big.
Oh my gosh, you guys, do not watch the new Borat movie. It is terrible. Save yourself. facing behind. Do you like my nails, Ignacio? Do you like my nails, Lena? So cute. And the great thing is that these stickers will not tangle in the hair. They will not make a mess. They will not snag because they are laid. So adorable. And you can add and add and add, layer, 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 until you are completely happy with the design, you guys. You have complete control over this. Can you imagine if we had to paint this, you guys? It would take all day.
Okay. I think that's good. What do you guys think? Put stickers away. We're gonna add, of course, a little bit of Prisma. You already know. Prisma is my bottom check. I love Prisma. Cut my sealer magic liner. We're gonna do two coats of shiny. The first one's gonna be ultra thin. Over the entire nail. And whether you're going to put like rhinestones or embellishments or glitter on top, I always recommend doing two coats of gel on the top to make sure you get the best finish and the best encapsulation of the glitter and the stickers. Take my Sailor Magic liner brush. Going to sprinkle a little bit of Prisma here. I'm just going to add a few sequences throughout the phalange. There's a bottom chick again. You already know, Nicole. All the girls with the jingle jingle. We are going over all the tricks for the most snatched sticker application with our brand new sticker line. What do you guys think? The adorbs. And of course I'm being really super extra, but I mean, you don't have to put as much as I do on the phalange.
What do you guys think? Isn't it adorable? Hmm? Did you call your friend Lina? Wendy. Oh, was she nice? Okay. Wow. Okay, so now we're going to bake this for 30 seconds. And then we're going to put one more layer of shiny on top to seal everything and just make it super, super magical looking, okay? So because these stickers are almost like photo quality, I always recommend to put two coats of gel on top because when you do that, it will really make the stickers come to life, you guys. And you guys know I, I did a lot of purple for you. Because I know you girls love purple. The purple gang. So we're gonna do one more coat of shiny. And then I'm gonna do a coat of shiny on the inside to bring out the transparency, the Cinderella realness. They are stunning. So let's go ahead and bake this for one minute inside the Dazzling Darling lamp. So beautiful. I actually think it took longer to do the design than it did to apply the nails with the DIY gel. No joke.
And you know we're going to finish with cotton candy cuticle oil. And remember, you can use our stickers with pretty much any surface. So on top of cat eye colors, you can do it on top of uh, the natural nail. You can do it on top of any one of our gel colors. You can do it on top of a pink. You can do it on top of happy gel. You can do it on top of um, a, a pinks, glitter gels. Just make sure that that glitter is really smooth. Hello, Max. Hola. Beautiful as always. And remember, after the hand comes out of the lamp, we're going to wait 10 seconds before we apply our cotton candy cuticle oil. You can also apply it on top of foils too, you guys. Okay, and the great thing is you cannot see the edge around the sticker. That was really important because I know a lot of people that makes them pressed. So let's apply a little bit of cotton candy cuticle oil around the cuticle area to keep it nice and moist. So make a bigger order, beautiful as always. See, beautiful, thank you. Now let's get a little bit of hard light for the girls. Look how adorable that is, you guys. Remember that Prisma, the way the light hits it. And the extreme square, she is no joke. And they're super thin too, so that way you can layer them. Look at that, so beautiful. Well, my loves, that's gonna wrap it up for today's live demo. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to check out our incredible DIY gel and our new sticker line. You guys are gonna love it and have so much fun with it. And make lots of money and create beautiful phalanges.